Hi, I'm Greg, and welcome back to AlternateCloud.com for more online training. As you can see, today I'm working from my RV while camping in Lakeport State Park, Michigan, just trying to get the last few days of summer in. Today's training is on XMarks, a free add-on for your web browser. An excellent add-on, I might add. Computer Magazine rates XMarks in the top 20 must-have. Today, we will look at three areas. One, what is XMarks and what it can do for you? Two, how easy it is to install on any of the top four browsers you may use. Google Chrome, Firefox, Internet Explorer, and Safari. And all four of them, in fact. Next, we'll look at how XMark organizes all your bookmarks and syncs them to all your browsers on your computer. Access your bookmarks from public computers via the Internet. And we'll see how this is all done very easy. Here we are on the XMarks.com website. It's a bookmark program that saves all your bookmarks and syncs them amongst multiple browsers and multiple computers. In fact, you can get your bookmarks from any computer in the world. Here's how to do it. First of all, on this website, before we click the install now, let's go to the learn more button and we'll see what it offers here. Now just think if you have your computer at work and it's Internet Explorer and it has say a hundred different bookmarks on that computer. When you get home and you get on your iMac or you have a laptop with Windows 7 installed, but once you get set up in this XMarks program, this program will sync all of your computers and all of your web browsers as if you're only using one computer and one web browser. You will have all your bookmarks all the time on all your computers and never lose a bookmark. One thing I want to show you is, say for instance, you have Internet Explorer at work. So first thing you're going to do is you want to install this program on your Internet Explorer at work. And again, it's a free add-on for your Chrome browser, which will sync all of your bookmarks with the other browsers that you set up. And we'll just quickly look up and install now. So you should see, get an idea of how easy it is to install. First of all, uh, download XMarks. It says XMarks is a free add-on for your browser that synchronizes and backs up all your bookmarks across multiple computers. XMarks also helps you find the best sites on the web based on what millions of other people are bookmarking. automatically and sync your bookmarks after every change. So in other words, if you delete a bookmark on Safari at your home computer, that bookmark will be deleted on your Internet Explorer computer at your work uh, station. Another thing, I won't be getting into this uh, in, in this video, but you can back up and sync your passwords. And you can learn more about top sites, as we said earlier, and you can find similar sites to your favorites with a single click. What we're going to do is we're going to download. So we'll click this. Firefox immediately pops up and it says it prevented this site. It's a security thing that I have set up. I'm just going to click allow only from authors you trust. Well, I trust this site because I went to it. It didn't come to me and I've already researched it and know that uh, it's a good site. Okay, let's go. We'll install now and your Xmarks will be installed after you restart Firefox. That's how fast it is. So we'll restart the computer now. And there, we've installed X marks on our Firefox. It was that quick. Okay, so now let's look at some more features here. I'm going to hold down the uh, control key on Windows or command key on Mac while I click and you'll notice up here that it will create a new tab. So I'm not taken away from this page. So there we have the new page here and if you're not familiar with tab browsing, there you go. It saves it there. Okay, so now we're going to click here to get an account. There we are today. I'm going to sign in here though. I have one so I'm going to. Okay we'll log in here. And it says remember your password. If I always click that because I don't want to forget it. And here we are. We are now logged into Xmarks, my bookmarks online. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up here and I'm going to create tab and I'm going to put my.xmarks dot com 
This will take me to my website online that hosts all my bookmarks. I'm going to add a new bookmark. I can add a new folder and I can even add a new divider so you can divide them up in areas of bookmarks. So let's, I'm going to add a new folder. So the new folder is going to be over here. I'm going to call it online training and location videos video training and learning okay and we're just going to click save you can put whatever you want in there i'm just putting some anything for now so there's our new so in this folder we we can also have subfolders so what i'm going to do is i'm going to create now a new bookmark and i'm going to have this new bookmark called alternate cloud alternate cloud and the software because my site has links to many different free software sites and i'm going to put training okay and we'll just click save that's good enough for now so you can see that it automatically i can do another one or i can go back but I'm going to close this out and there. So now we've created a new online training folder. And in that folder is my first bookmark. So I can click that bookmark and we'll open that up in a new tab. And there it is there, my website. And there we have it, my website. Let's go back. Okay, so what else do we have? We can delete. Okay, well, I'm not going to do that. Details. Let's look at details. I can go into bookmarks and, okay, here's a user guide. I don't know what that user guide is. So that's a user guide product line of iLink. Now I know what that is. That's iLink. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put that in and save. So now you can see it updated it over here. And that's great because I didn't know what user guide was for and now you can do a search. I can do a search for free. And there we go. Less than different things that are free. Um, training. Okay. Different things I've got in there. I haven't really set up these bookmarks yet. Okay. So preview. You can preview bookmarks. So in this instance, I'm going to go to App Central, which is a great uh, online show about apps with Amber MacArthur if you ever get a chance to look at it. But what it does is if you just click on it and it previews the actual website. You don't have to open up the website. You can just have a quick look at it. And it gives you a preview. You can preview your bookmarks without opening them. Now here's one here you can share. I'm going to get App Central. Okay, you can share this folder. That's even better. So I'm going to share this folder. And there. Sets it all up. You're in, so who am I going to share it with? I will just put uh, myself actually. And I'll send myself an email. And there's a sample email. So you can see Xmarks is very versatile. Well, that's it for Xmarks today. I hope you give it a try. And don't forget to click on the links on your screen for more information. You Mac users, you might like to check out my new upcoming series on Mountain Lion video training at alternatecloud.com. And please keep sending in those comments. I really appreciate it and any new ideas that you may have. See you later at alternatecloud.com.